I'll be doing a Hype Fury review and demo today. Now this tool has some very powerful automation features to help grow your Twitter X following, and I'm very excited to show them to you. But there are a few things that I would love to have Hype Fury improve, and I'll show those to you as well. So with that said, let's get started with this Hype Fury review and demo. Hype Fury is a social media posting tool that primarily focuses on Twitter X. Now you can use this tool to automatically publish onto your, um, your LinkedIn account, Instagram, Facebook, and you can also connect your Gumroad account as well if you sell various uh, digital products. Now this tool isn't like Sprout Social or uh, Buffer where those ones really target all of the social media platforms. This one is very, very specific towards Twitter X and a handful of other platforms as well. It's more similar to tools like FeedHive, TweetHunter, Typefully, Slapo, and Publer. Now, I recommend checking out their free tools on their website because they're actually pretty helpful. They have a Twitter X and Instagram bio generator, and they even have their content ideas generator, which I've been using for a handful of months now, and it's actually pretty good. Now, the idea that this AI generates really depends on the topic, audience, and result you add to this form to prompt it. There's a unique way I go about this in terms of choosing um, the topic, um, the specific audience I want to speak to, and also the result they want to achieve. And it just helps me come up with some really, really cool tweets that I haven't have thought of in the past. And I actually want to share that unique process with you. So I recorded a secret video of how you can use this content idea generator completely free. So you have an unlimited uh, number of ideas to um, post on your Twitter X profile. Now, if you want free access to that secret video, it's about five minutes long. Uh, just click the link in the description and check out that video where I teach you uh, my favorite tips on using this free tool. So let's go to the Hype Fury backend. You have your queue here with predefined slots. Okay, so right now I have slots for every day at 2 p.m. Now you can edit this by clicking on schedule. You can add a slot if you wish by choosing the platform. So Twitter, LinkedIn, Facebook, and or Instagram. How many days, like every day, only the weekdays, weekends, and so on. And also choose the time and then click on save and your queue will be updated. Now to create a post, just click on create. And this is where you can create all of your tweets. Now, if you want to add another tweet below it to turn it into a thread, just click on add tweet to add that second tweet to the first one. So once you are finished with your tweet thread, you can add a few additional things as well, like a thread finisher. So this is a predefined tweet that attaches to the end of the thread to encourage people to uh, follow you and also retweet the thread as well. Now, if you don't want to just click on this red icon, you can also add a DM me button, which makes it very easy for people to send you a direct message. You can also add your media GIFs at a poll, and you can also add this tweet into a specific category that you've created. And I'll show you more about these categories in a moment. And you can also do an auto plug. So with the auto plug, you can automatically add a follow up tweet to your post. So just put your text right here. And then you can delay this auto plug until um, 100 retweets or likes, and you can decide the number you want right here and click on save. So whenever this tweet gets up to five likes, then Hype Fury will automatically plug that tweet with this one right here at the bottom of it. And you can also set this as a conditional retweet as well. So that basically means Hype Fury will retweet this after a specific number of um, hours or days and until it reaches certain criteria like number of retweets or number of likes. And if you click on this down arrow, you can also post this to your LinkedIn, Facebook, and Instagram. And you can also save this to a draft and it'll be added to your drafts folder. And one of my favorite tools about Hype Fury is the prompts. So you have tons of prompts that you can review to get your creative juices flowing to plan out all of your tweets. So you can view um, your best tweets that you've published in the past and uh, reuse these tweets. You can um, take a look at various uh, templates here, um, marketing specific prompts, 
unpopular opinions, and there's tons of different categories that you can browse, and you can view all of your drafts right here. I currently don't have any, so it's blank. You can also view the prompts again, view all of your recurrent posts, so posts that automatically repost it according to the specific day and time you've set. Now, this one is really cool because Hype Fury will automatically tweet according to what you've scheduled. So say for example, for Wednesday at 2 p.m., I can create a category named tools. So all of the tweets that I've categorized as tools will automatically be published every single Wednesday at 2 p.m. And of course, you can add additional categories whenever you want as well. So say for example, I want to post a tools tweet every Thursday at 9 a.m. and then click on add recurrent posts. So Hypefury will cycle through all of my tweets that are categorized as tools every single week. So basically every single day, I will have something posted on my Twitter account. Now to add tweets to your categories, just click here and then just click on any category. And here is a list of all of the tweets under your category. So if you want to make sure that you are tweeting every single day to grow your audience or sell a specific product, then these recurrent posts are very helpful to have Hypefury automatically just tweet out defined prepackaged tweets you've created already. And we also have these power-ups. So you have the Tweet Booster where you automatically retweet your own tweets to give them more visibility. And I just showed you this um, when we clicked on the Create Conditional Retweet. There's also the Auto Retweeter where every 24 hours, there's also the Auto Un Retweeter. So every 24 hours, it will unretweet all the tweets you retweeted in the last 24 hours. You have the Twitter auto plug. So this will auto reply to your own tweets or promos in the comments. LinkedIn auto plug. You can upload a CSV file. You can also upload archived tweets from your tweets.js file. You can also post your tweet onto Instagram. There's also the auto retweeter as well. So some really cool features to make sure you are posting every single day, getting your posts out there to a broader audience. Now they also have an engagement builder. Now this is actually one of my favorite tools as well. So you basically add your favorite um, Twitter accounts here. And every time they post, they will be added to this live feed. So you can review all the tweets that your list has been posting out and you can engage with them in this screen. So you don't need to open up Twitter or use your phone. You could just use this engagement builder to engage with your top followers. They also have the My Mentions feature as well. So every time someone mentions you, it will be added to this list where you can start engaging with people who mention you on Twitter. They also have auto DMs. Now this one is pretty cool because you can give something away for free by having people DM you and Hypefairy will automatically reply to that Twitter DM with a specific link. Okay, so this is something that I created the other day. So um, this is my tweet and the criteria for auto DM is if the user responds to my post. And this is the specific DM that Hypefury will automatically DM to the person who responded to my post. Okay, so let me show you how it works. So start a campaign. You will put your tweet right here. And then this is the DM your users will receive after um, they replied to that tweet, retweeted it, reply and retweet or reply or retweet. So this is a great feature because this will encourage people to engage with your post. And since Hypefury will automatically DM them, it'll open up a conversation with all of your followers as well. So you can grow your network um, through these types of auto DM campaigns. They also have Gumroad sales. Now, I don't have a Gumroad account, so I didn't try this one. Um, they also have time-based sales. Now, this one is pretty unique as well. So basically, you can tweet out any specific sale you want. And Hypefury will tweet out countdowns. So you can put your tweet here and select a sale start time and sale duration. And Hypefury will automatically add a tweet to the bottom of that first one every like 90 minutes, 60 minutes, 45 minutes, and so on. And after this sale campaign is over, the tweet will automatically get deleted. So the sale basically lasts for a couple of hours. And once it ends, Hypefury will delete that post. They also have analytics as well. Now, this is one feature I think Hypefairy can definitely improve. 
So you can see the engagements uh, per tweet over the last uh, seven days. You can also increase it to you know 90 days as the max. You can view the engagement rate, the impressions, your current tweet statistics, like how many tweets you've published today, 14-day uh, average, and so on. And you can also view a list of all the tweets that you've uh, published. And you can analyze the impressions, the engagements, engagement rates, and so on. And you can also analyze your followers. So you can view this over the last so number of days and see this line graph to see how many followers you've gained every single day. And you can take a look at your followers' daily growth. Now, this information is helpful, but in terms of how it looks, I think uh, they can improve upon the, the UI. I also would love to be able to pick specific dates and not just these four options. Another thing I wish Hypefury was able to add was the fact that when you take a look at these tweets, you can't you can't actually read the tweet. You can only read the first you know three or four words. So you would actually need to uh, click and go to Twitter to view the tweet. So right now I don't really know what I wrote. So it's hard to kind of uh, figure out what tweets are doing well because I can't read them. So I wish they can um, fix this list right here. You can also view the history. Now this is cool because um, it'll show you all the tweets regardless of whether or not you posted it via Hypefury. So if you did it natively, those tweets will be added here as well. You can also track your evergreen posts as well. So you can view your evergreen posts by the number of retweets they've received, likes, impressions, and so on. And then you can view your auto plug metrics. So this is Hypefury in a nutshell. Now, aside from the analytics, I think the UI UX can be improved. They actually recently updated the UI, but I think it's not that easy to uh, navigate. And sometimes I get confused about where to click and I need to go back and try to figure out you know, how to do certain things. So I think the UI UX can be improved, but I really, really like the engagement builder. Um, the my mentions and also the auto dm time-based sales i think those four features are what makes hype very very unique so if you really want to grow your audience and engage with people very easily i think hype Fury is an excellent tool for you to try now again um you know when it comes to hype Fury, you need to figure out what to tweet out right so for me it does take a lot of time to figure out what to tweet. So I like to use their AI to generate post ideas. Now there's a unique way that I personally use this to make sure it generates A plus content. Now I created a secret video of me overviewing how to use this tool the right way. So if you want access to that secret video, click the link in the description and you'll get access to that secret five minute video. Now, um, hopefully you enjoyed this Hype Fury review and demo. Um, hit that like button, subscribe to my channel, and if you want to check out my other videos, feel free to click any of the ones on the screen. Thank you, and I'll see you in the next one.